Airdrop season is in full swing. For some of these opportunities, you have to take action as soon as possible. Let's go! Drift launched their points program. We don't know exactly how you get points, but of course from different activities on the Drift protocol platform. What I personally like to do is use the earned products, for example, uh, investing in a market making vault or uh, providing liquidity via DLP. And of course, you should also trade. Um, as I'm not a trader and I don't like to lose money, I will uh, go to perpetuals and uh, then go long on asset A on drift and I'll go short on asset A on SETA. With that, I'm farming two airdrops from two different protocols in one strategy. Coming to Rango Exchange. Rango Exchange is a cross-chain bridge and on Interact they currently have a quest here. You should uh, follow their uh, social media channels and you can also swap assets into Linea. Uh, Rango um, supports about 50 different blockchains and you can swap from one blockchain to Linea. And uh, with that way you're farming uh, different airdrops because on the one side you're farming uh, layer zero. You're also farming the Linea airdrop with um, generating volume via this bridge and you're farming the Rango airdrop here. Rabbi Wallet just published their points program, another points program, you hey. With a referral code, you can uh, go into Rabbi and to their points program and uh, claim with a, a code your points. I like Rabbi very much. I'm not using MetaMask anymore. I also created a very short uh, video about the advantages of Rabbi. I'll link it down below in the description. Check it out. It's definitely worthwhile. On Galaxy, you can find the Chroma quest line. These are different phases and uh, you have to finish this till the 28th of January actually. Chroma is a layer 2 Ethereum scaling solution and as we've seen with the Manta airdrop, another layer 2 Ethereum scaling solution, doing these uh, quest lines and uh, acquiring NFTs was very important for the airdrop. Altlayer have uh, published the uh, distribution of their airdrop. A big part goes to NFT holders and campaign participants, but also restakers on Eigenlayer and uh, Celestia stakers get a part of the airdrop. If you are not a restaker on Eigenlayer so far, if you don't restake your Ethereum, I can highly recommend checking out KelpDAO. Tell me if you want a tutorial on these protocols. And of course, as a Celestia staker, which you should be doing, staking Celestia is uh, very worthwhile. You got a lot of airdrops already and you will be getting more airdrops in 2024. All right, friends, that wraps up the airdrop alpha. Hit that subscribe button and see you on the other side.